Hey guys, what's up? I'm Captain Turbo, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man 2. Uh, unfortunately, we started the video in the last part. I uh, couldn't do anything about it. It's just the way the game works. And I'm already getting my ass into my birds. Great, uh, but we're actually in the wireless stages now, and this is probably one of the most iconic uh, Mega Man pieces of music, so we'll let this play for a minute or so. Anyway guys, you've heard enough of that I think. Back to my charming voice. Uh, but yeah, this is um, definitely where things begin to get a little bit tricky, mainly because um, the wireless stages have some really annoying boss fights and you know the, this level really wants you to take advantage of everything that you've picked up so far. So, And it's also pretty long. I actually think the wireless stages, there's nearly, there's got to be something like what? There's a toe, toe trick there. He can't hit me, but I can hit him. I think there's like f five, maybe six wireless stages. There's nearly as many as there is a um, normal robot master stages. Uh, this is a bit of an annoying um, part, which is why I'm going to say so here. But I just don't like this part. And essentially, because if you do this wrong so many times, you're going to have to start grinding for uh, energy tanks. Uh, thankfully, I did it on my first try though. I'm sorry guys, I'm just listening to the music myself. A little bit track. And oh, this is also a pretty difficult one as well. Anyway, I'm going to get a quick boomerang set up now because we're going to take on the boss in a few moments actually. Safe state right here because I'm not going to go for the entire level again just to screw up at the boss yet again. Make sure your platforming skills are at least somewhat comfortable. Competent, I should say. And a motherfucking dragon that comes out of nowhere. <laughs> Kinda looks stupid though, I mean, Barney looks more frightening than this thing. Uh, be careful, this thing can make your life hell if you fall off. Ah, but beat it on my first try, that's surprising. But yeah, if you fall off there, you have to start not just at the beginning of the, um, side scrolling section there again, you have to start that entire level again. I mean it's only about three minutes long but it can still be pretty damn annoying. But you know what, with the speed we're going at here, this may only be a four-parter. Yeah, it looks like it's five levels. And if you need refilling, uh, item three actually could do with it. It doesn't refill it all the way up but, you know, better than nothing. care of these guys. And yeah, you can hear the music is still the same. Not really a bad thing, I mean, it's a great track. Alright, uh, get out of the two equipped again. Just keep riding this. Do not take that first ladder, by the way. It's easier to just take the second one, plus you get an extra uh, energy tank. Extra life. And we can refill a bit decent uh, chunk of uh, item 2 anyway. So don't worry, you'll be able to get it back. Uh, free uh, life and energy tank down there. Unfortunately, as I said, I'm already maxed out, so I can't get any more. Nearly died there. Alright. Uh, pretty annoying here. Because you're gonna get. We're back to using these fuckers again. I do not like these things. Only because you can't really shield yourself against them if you're kind of below them or underneath them or anything like that. And there's so many of them. And frankly, we're at the end of that and I get hit by the slowest moving thing in the world there. Alright, uh, item 3 again careful there. 
I think they're actually instant death, so we'll try not to run into them. Uh, what am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm trying to just re-equip the metal blades, aren't I? Alright. Careful here, since there's two of the fuckers. I, actually, no, I don't think they are instant death. But they will take quite a big chunk of damage off you. So yeah, I'm just occasionally safe staying just in case I need it. We're actually at the boss now. Uh, parts of the wall will basically come undone here and will make your life hell. Uh, this is actually not that hard of a boss, but these things will speed up as the um, boss goes along. So make sure you, you're keeping an eye out on um, how fast they're going, and they also do quite a bit of damage as well, so uh, you know, steer clear of them if you can. Alright, I need to refill my health actually, so. Energy tank. You know, I could not have taken another hit, hit there, so. Good idea to use that tank. One more, I think. Yep, there we go. And that's Wild Stage 2 done. to wireless stage 3. This is actually going a lot, I mean, not a perfect run by any means, but it's going a lot better than um, <laughs> uh, Mega Man 1 did. And as you can see, as you can hear, sorry, uh, different music now to the one that was playing a few minutes ago. Completely new, actually. Uh, don't, I could really, I could actually do with the energy tanks, but never mind. I've got three. That should be enough. I think I can also pick some up uh, other places. Uh, I can actually do with Actually, no, I'm actually pretty healthy on the uh, energy, so I don't really need it. And this is also different. I don't actually think I mentioned it earlier in the um, Bubble Man stage, but the game actually has water physics now. Uh, Mega Man will jump a lot uh, higher when he's in water, so... Oh yeah, I can't kill those things, can I? Uh, which is nice, you know, it's something that, as I said, they didn't bring into this game. You know, Mega Man 1 did not have it, sadly. Oh, and I think this is one of the harder parts as well. But the game's like to just kind of fuck with you here. Like that. Yeah, I saved stated right here, just in case. Can I do it? Yeah, I think I've done it. Yeah, I did. Thankfully. Yeah, kind of a dick move that uh, you can sort of see what's going to happen when uh, you go below the screen, you know, it'll scroll like this. Unfortunately, you can't really react quite as fast as they want you to. <laughs> I'm trying to think, actually, it might be safer than me to use my normal. Uh... I did not mean to pick that up with that, but never mind. I'm trying to think what the boss is here, I can't for the life of me remember. Oh, I know what this guy is. Get you a bit of quick boomerang equipped. And go to town on arguably the easiest boss in this entire game. And there we go. For such a big... I, I think it's Guts Tank or something like that, but for such a big enemy, he's a complete cakewalk. that we're gonna move on to Wily Stage 4. This may be three parts, I can't believe it. Also, uh, but this is a pretty long level if I remember correctly. Alright, so I wanna get Metal Blades. I don't know if I'll be using item 3 again. Hmm. So I'll, I'll just feel a lot better if I yeah, I'll feel a lot better if I have it, at least if I, I, I... I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. I, I can carry on with the level now. I'll probably just do this level and then I'll call it quits for this episode. And why not? Oh, it disappeared. Fuck, that's not fair. Extra life down there. Don't... Uh, with save states, I'm not going to bother going for the extra lives like that, so... The ladder. Matangs I actually find to be really fucking annoying. Uh, 
Be careful here, get your bubble out, and it will basically show you where there's some pits. Unfortunately, I completely missed that first one. Did not miss that one, though. Actually, I might keep bubble equipped just for now. Uh, instant death spikes as well there. Uh, this one's pretty late on, if I remember. Yep. There we go. I'm actually going to go for that, just so I can have it. Uh, which is actually a good idea to have item 1. I'm trying to remember... No, it does the thing. So it's this one platform right here. And there we go. So yeah, I'm back uh, now back up to 4 energy tanks. Or E-tanks. I'm not sure what it's called. I get confused between this and uh, Super Metroid. Or just Metroids. Uh, Energy tanks. Oh, that was actually a bad move on my part. Uh, thankfully, I was able to grab the uh, ladder again. Yeah, be careful here. I'm actually going to put Woodman. Uh, no, I want to go down the ladder. Thank you. Toss that down. And basically, your Lee Shield here should protect you from pretty much everyone here. Thank you, I'll have that back. Uh, be patient here with this one, wait for it to come down. And there you go. Simple as that. Yeah, I, I have to admit, uh, coming to play this in 2015 for the first time, actually, I was... A I, I like these, these games, don't get me wrong. I was a little disappointed. You know, you hear horror stories about, oh, this is such a hard game and all that. And I'm like, really? I mean, it's not easy by any stretch of the imagination, but it's not exactly hard. You know, Event Trial and 2, now there is a hard game in my opinion. You know, and other games like um, Castlevania 3 and all that. You know, and this doesn't really stack up in terms of difficulty compared to those games. So I was hoping one of them might drop something, but unfortunately they didn't. Uh, Got two, uh, item 2 out here. I'm gonna wait for this thing to come around, unfortunately. And that'll take us straight across. I don't think you can make that jump, so I mean, that's why I use that. I'm gonna get the walkers back again, the walker Joes, I believe they're called. Unfortunately, you're gonna have to take a hit there. Oh, fuck that. Oh yeah, this is fair. Alright, we got the crash bomb uh, boss now. This is kind of a dick boss because of... You, you basically can do this in one run. And I'm going to try and do it in one run. In fact, I'm going to save because I want to do this in one run. But you need to be careful because you can't screw this up more than once. Sorry, I was, wait I was trying to avoid getting hit. Unfortunately, I still got hit. I did manage to take that out, thankfully, though. That's two down. Actually, I, I feel it feel better if I got my uh, health back. Alright, so now that I'm out of there, I need to use item three. To get out of there. Alright. Uh, use Crash Bomb again here. Uh, managed to avoid that. Using the one there. I'm um, probably going to have to use item 3 again here. Yes, I did. Never mind. Alright, uh, Crash Bomb once again. I've got 3 more hits with that. 2 now, because I've used it there. I got 1 more hit with Crash Bomb. I did not mean to fall down there, but never mind. Use item 1. just managed it. There we go. And that's why it's a bit of a dick level, simply because, as you can see there, it completely depleted my entire uh, crash bomb thing, and unfortunately you don't get a refill. Um, 
entrance of the level. It's, it's just a really big, badly designed boss in my opinion. But anyway guys, we're 50 minutes in, we got two, well, one level left. Well, one level in the credits, so the final boss, I guess. And we got the boss rush first, I forgot about this. So we'll do this in the next part, guys. Hope you enjoy this, and I'll see you next time. But until then, have a good night.